It, I, I always, like, it makes me so happy when people say they've been around for a long time. Because I'm just like, aw, you guys like me. You really like me. Also, a little bit... Oh, yeah, dumb. Less than 1k. This is the weirdest thing here. Where, um... I have... I'm doing this with a controller, but I have, like, a mouse control. Sort of, of where I want to go for the menu. It's so odd, but I like it. <laughs> Prez, that was early in the days. That was... You had to be part of the first 200. And I appreciate you for that, our meme master. You had to be part of the first 200. Oh, I am moving the whole screen. Okay. That's better. Oh! Got my controller falling out of my lap. Oh, Lion, I'm happy you came through from that, though. A lot of people came out from, um, RDR2, which is awesome. It's always fun to, like, I don't know, it's cool to have people come in from different communities and just become, like, a mosh pit, like a cult. I think it's fun. Azir, it's no longer Sekiro, I'm sorry. We streamed Sekiro for about five and a half hours, I think. And then we decided we're gonna switch it up a little. Okay, let me make sure that's going. YouTube is up to something because a couple of your friends. Oh, if you interact, um, I think it's a way they go through your metadata. If you have uh, contacts with people and you share similar interests, it kind of does that. Let me remember all these buttons. That is, I love this mechanic, but also the idea of just shoving your hand in a beehive and taking the honey. Oh, Sensei, sorry, I should have alerted the community better. Um, power went out, I was able to get back on. We did not go that far in Sekiro, so I ended up stopping. And now we have just started Dying Light 2 if you would like to hang out with us. What now? It always happens when Sarah's around. Sarah, and then Lamb is guilty of it too. I don't know if Lamb is still here, but Lamb really buys into my desire to, um, sexualize Genichiro Ashina. Back to fondling the bees. Oh no, not the bees. Okay. I'm trying to... I just finished a main mission. I finished, um... For those of you who have been watching other people's playthroughs of DL2, I just finished the hospital mission and I'll be uploading that to YouTube tomorrow. Oh yes, the slowpoke guy, crap. I can't do anything with him, I need money. It can't... Oh. Did you see him throw the weapon? And then get it back. Um, the question, the exclamation point that's behind me for a mission. I can't interact with that guy because I'm broke. He wants to race, but I need money to do so. I am so excited to upgrade the skill tree here. That way I just, I feel like you move better. And it was the same way in the first game where you just move better when you have your skill tree upgraded. Let's see. I, there's a couple of places that I could actually check out here. Edna mode. Ooh. Discover this location. I don't have the stamina to unlock that safe house. Lion, I know. I was dumbstruck by this game. It is gorgeous. It's also considerably more difficult than the first one, just the mechanics, which I like because now you actually have like a stamina bar when you're climbing and doing important things that keeps you from 
moving on to certain places. Oh, it's fuck no. Oh. The other guy's dead, though. Nope, oh, come on. You got this, Aiden. Oh. Sensei, I would love to, that first friend. I'm sure some of them still do. But, um, the one that I played with the most. I, um, I can't say that we don't talk anymore, but it's definitely different. See, my stamina is terrible. Oh. Oh, yep, see. That's okay, though. There's no death counter for this one. The parries are slow. The parries feel more like um, Dark Souls parries. The trash talk in here is insane wicked. Because you're talking to a bunch of cannibals. Psychotic cannibals. And it's kind of just wild. Um, be careful with the death command, because it might add on to our Sekiro commands. Oh. I want this beehive. Die, Zombo. Oh, hey, you're still alive. Come say hi to these zombies. Get him, Zombo. Not me. soup going on here. Okay. Oh, see. Did you guys kill the zombos? Yeah, see. This one is significantly harder. I'm also playing on hard, so... It's a good time, though. I might just have to abandon this for a while. Because my goal is to get to these question marks and hopefully along the way find things, stimulant packs that I can use to upgrade my stamina. Because right now she ain't too hot. Oh, the accent of these characters, they have these strangest accents. I think I've already been over here. What? Oh, I cannot touch that. That is a night only mission for the sake of my survival. Wander around looking for stimulants. There's a lot of um, stimulant like use in this game. Because you can also use shrooms. I haven't figured out what they do yet. Or if they really have to do anything. But there are shrooms. It's over here. Oh, 
Oh, night. Oh, I have to activate this. Oh, no. I have no idea. Oh, I can move this. You hear they're good for soup? The shrooms or the zombies? Ah, here's the generator. I was like, why is the lockbox what I need for the safe house? Okay, oh, safe code. That's just what we wanted. That and shrooms. Um. Oh, yes, that was it. 101. Okay. You go nightbot mode in the after hours? Oh no, I might have made a mistake. I might have made a mistake. Wait, I'm confused. Is it literally 101? I guess it was! English only. Oh yes, the inhibitor! Okay. That's my stimulant, I need three of those. Combo would have been zero, zero, zero. Um, can I leave out of here? I can. Sweet. Oh, there's a survivor to help over here. I ran past one of these poor guys. They had him. Oh, do they have this one up in a cage too? They do. Let me do this. Combat skill, there we go. I don't know how you can like knock out, well he's snapping their necks, so that is one thing. I can't die like this. I'm coming, just hold up, sir. Hey, get me out of this thing. I'm getting there. Help me, stranger, yeah. please. I'm pretty sure there's a simpler way to do this than how I do it, but this is what works. You good? Sir. I can't thank you enough for saving me. But take this. Oh, electricity. <laughs> you absolutely can die like this. He could have died in the fall, honestly, but I wouldn't have felt responsible for that because I didn't put him there. not any way to get up here. Oh, maybe. No, not like that. All right, I'm missing quite a few things out of the skill tree that I really want. Including the wall run. Like you would think in a parkour game, the wall run would be like basic, but no, it's far up in the skill tree. Okay, we want Dodge an enemy at the right time to stagger them when dropping onto enemies from above. Yes, the power kick. Let's go. All right, that's the subway. We're not, I'm not brave enough to mess with that just yet. At least not during the day. Oh, I see. Kill zombies to gym. Oh. Uh, just, um, easier to go this way. 
Ice in her veins. Hayden, I know you can make that jump. I need to play Assassin's Creed Odyssey at some point. I just don't know when I'll get around to it. Oh, safe house? Ridiculous blockade at the center. You don't strike me as no, the I type path. Play We're in the middle of school right now. No field trips. Here, maybe this studious looking young man will help. I don't know what about me looks studious to you, sir. What's going on here? Hello, I'm Henkel. This student here was curious about my lesson today, about when the guns were confiscated in Villador, and what happened afterwards. He wants to light a candle on the site of the March Massacre. Okay. The March Massacre? Yes. 64 people died that day. Gunned down like sitting ducks. If you want to know more, you should go and see for yourself. Why can't he? No one can leave the building while school is in session. Children shouldn't walk around the bazaar on their own. Okay. Hmm. I thought you'd be more worried about them falling into a dark zone. Oh, kids nowadays are too smart to fall into a silly hole. Anyway, could you? Light a candle for him, young man. You might learn something yourself. Sure, though I was pretty lousy at history. History is boring when someone tells you about it. It starts being fascinating when you can touch it. Touch it? Yes, take this candle and go to the monument of the World Art Congress. Or what's left of it. It's close by. Contact me when you get there. You'll see what my lesson was about today. Okay, we got a mission to go light a candle. We can do some trading, which I kind of need to do because I'm holding a lot of uh, valuables that I can sell. It is a little bit slower right now, especially because it just has let me open up the map. It feels more like... The second half of Dying Light 1, where you go into the different part of the city, um, further towards the stadium, that's what more this feels like. I just want to sell you things, dude. Oh, you're a craft master. Okay. Uh, UV bar, that would be helpful. Yeah, I'm broke. I'm like broke, you broke. Are good to go. All right, that's the bazaar over there. That's where I need to go. Also, the music is so intense for no reason. Nothing's happening. Um, that is a train system. That's an encounter. Maybe it's the encounter. Oh no, it's the history lesson. Okay. Let's do... No, stop it. Is it tracking? I can never tell. Yes. All right, yep, we're good. Uh, just fall down. He's really into the steampunk life. Probably could get away with that, honestly. Oh, that looks dangerous. I will say something I cannot wait to get my hands on is the grappling hook. Oh, this is right above me. You got this. There's a lot of little moments like this which I really enjoy. I have no idea why the music keeps playing. It's most likely- oh, let's see if it does it again. 
Keep your coins, fools. They are of no use. Oh yeah, it just keeps going. It wants you to always be in the moment. The psychology of just having constant music to keep the blood pumping. Well, someone saw us, because they announced it. Okay, there's someone over here. You got this, dude! Oh, I was hoping it would let me grab him. Ooh, I see. There we go. Dude, you want to back off. Oh, it was- Oh, you were supposed to die. You lost a leg. I did not know that he was not a survivor. He was a bandit to be killed. Okay. You know what? I'll take it. There we go. He has no more leg, and that's okay. Now we're being chased, and that's also okay. Oh, don't tell me it's below me. Oh, it's gotta be in there. I want the inhibitor! That's where it wants to go. Hey, Hankel. I'm at the monument. You were right. Not much left of it. Good. Look closely. There is much more to it than meets the eye. Really? Let's play. I can't just look at this monument in peace. <laughs> Why do you keep throwing things? See, that's what kills me about these ones, is they will just throw things repeatedly. Get them, Zombos! friend died okay ah, there's a plaque here Oof, a lot of names on it are those the victims of a massacre yeah 64 names things were starting to get pretty bad outside the walls around then and the army needed more weapons so they confiscated the civilians weapons Private ownership of any sort of firearm and its ammunition was forbidden thereafter. I just realized something. That's a little bit better. Okay. No way I'm not blocking the subtitles. Also, Igor, please have a good night. Sleep well. What happened here? That is where the riot started. People were terrified. How could they protect themselves and their families? There was massive unrest. So, a curfew was put in place. And homes were raided to ensure no one was hiding any weapons. Punishment for those who didn't comply was quite severe. Yeah, Kaido, to answer the question, yeah, it's basically zombies and parkour. Investigate the rest of the square. Inhibitor container detected. Shots were fired. The 
army started shooting at people. Panic broke out. And of course, things only got worse. The riots escalated. It was the beginning of the end. Tony, no worries. Please have a good night. Thank you for being with us. So you're saying that Pratt made a bad call, taking people's guns away? Hard to know for sure, but it didn't end well for anyone. In fact, the main irony <laughs> is that the army soon ran out of ammunition. And just like that, firearms became obsolete. At least, that's what's generally believed to have happened. Now, you'll hear some folks claim that Pratt kept a secret stash of ammunition somewhere in the city. But if so, he took that secret to the grave. So I guess we'll never really know. And that's the thing about history. We rarely ever really know. It's not a hard science. History is fragile as the passing of time. It takes the vigilance of people like myself to make sure it's not rewritten to suit the whim of each new generation's self-righteous fight. The duty of remembrance. Everyone should practice it. Farewell now, Pilgrim. I hope this little trip down memory lane has illuminated your path. Okay, so what I got out of there is there's hidden ammunition somewhere in the city. Also, a little bit more on the story for those of you that don't know. Basically, this character Aiden was experimented on as a child. And something about that made him stronger and faster than most people. And now he's looking for his sister who he got separated from when they were kids. And also, he's uh, very close to turning, so if I ever go out of the sunlight, there's a little marker up at the center that basically tells me that um, our boy's about to become a zombo. Oh, really? Aiden, why you no kill? Okay. I wanted the inhibitor that's probably in there. It reminds you of the Maze Runner. I honestly, in kind of a way, it does, because there were certain cities and groups of people that were blocked off from the rest of society. Inhibitor container detected. It's it's in that building. It's got to be. Ooh. Oh, I don't even know if I can climb that. Yeah, it's right there. I hate these. <laughs> how would you operate a bread maker if you don't know how to read? Sarah, how are you going to operate your bread maker? She's not going to use one. She will refuse. Flat out refusal. It would make your life so much easier. When in your life have you ever made bread or have considered making bread from scratch? I can kill at least once a day. I sleep better. <laughs> if I can kill once a day, I sleep better. <laughs> See, that barely does anything. I've got you now, asshole. <laughs> this SpongeBob Yodel they do. Not the Zombo. If you want to call zombies to you, that's your business. Oh, 
Get him, Zombo. Grab his face. Oh no, there's someone behind me. Hey there, jackass! Combat is so slow in the beginning. I am holding so many different weapons. Oh, let's go into the zombos. Out of here, sir. Or help. You could also do that. Oh. <laughs> Get him, dude. Oh, nice job. Hit him. There we go. I don't know how to thank you. Will this do? Oh, yes. An immunity booster. Jack, it's better. Oh, no, Impurity. What happened while I was focusing? Use kitchen aid mixer, but not a bread machine. Okay, but she needs to fit know the bread machines are a naturally occurring part of life. And it's not blasphemy to own one. These physics are so heavy and lofty right now, which I expected, because the first game was kind of like that. Handmade croissants and bread are better. That might be true. But honestly, if you have a bread machine, count yourself lucky and just use it. It's naturally occurring because humans made it and humans are a part of nature. That's what I'm going with. <laughs> You're sending my mom a bread maker. Please do. I, I would never steal it. I would never steal her bread maker. Ooh. Ooh, Gordon Ramsay burnt croissants? Sir, what are you doing? I can't say anything. I watched that video where he cut a chicken into all of its different parts um, blindfolded. And while part of my brain does not think that's impressive, the other part of me is like, you can do it. Oh, see, that was the drugs. That weird blue mist on my hands, that was the shrooms. I haven't quite figured out what they do yet. Oh, it's a, no, that's not a windmill. I mean, I know there's a windmill to my left, but that's not what I'm here for. This thing is so heavy. Oh my god, I'm surrounded by the things. <laughs> Why 
is it always a forsaken zone? Cooking stream featuring Sarah? It would be chaotic, but it would be... I know it's under me. It'd be chaotic, but it would be great. Burn everything. Right. Haven't seen them for weeks. Pilgrim. We spotted specials in the neighborhood. Keep your eyes peeled. Oh. I will do my best. She can try to force the old ways on me as much as she wants. She will never win. Follow the checkpoints to reach the finish line as quickly as possible. Oh, I mean, I'll do it, but also I won't do well because of stamina. Oh, this reminds me of the old Mirror's Edge challenges. Yeah, okay. Thought that was ground. It wasn't ground. <laughs> oh my god, Sarah. I can't believe you. Oh, I'm gonna say I was distracted by Sarah and her lack of use of her English degree, which she worked very hard for. Okay, this runs really bad. Yeah, this is not smooth. All right, let's not do what I did before. Screaming for help, could you please calm down while I do this? Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, okay. I thought that would be the last one. It is not. Someone give Nightbot a sub. Oh, no. Nightbot basically is a sub. Nightbot is just here. Will you get a bread maker? For the sake of the joke, what if that is the first community giveaway as a bread maker? Impurity! No, not over the bread maker! Not over the bread maker! <laughs> Really? For the bread makers. Oh, Aiden, 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 you fool. With a panini maker? Oh 
man. Wait, was the was the bet that Sarah would give someone a bread maker or Sarah would get a bread maker? Oh. A waffle maker. Oh, she'll get one. Will she use it? Sarah, if I get you a bread maker, will you use it? Yes or no? Oh, I fudged. She'll be forced to use it if she has it. Okay. Yes, I agree, but what if she takes it apart for spare parts? And then just uses it to build an old style, I don't know, bread grinder. I don't know how they made bread. Sarah, how did they make bread back in the day? What if she reverse engineers the bread maker? Aiden! She'll turn it into a Kevin! Oh no. Honestly, I think she can do it. I didn't know, Jazz. I, I don't know how they make bread. <laughs> a yeast grinder or something? I don't know. I was not part of the bread-making community in my previous lives. And I know that. <laughs> there had to be some grinding involved, I don't know. Aiden, quit doing that. Oh, no, no, no. <sighs> the pause and then the death. Become bread thy creature. <laughs> oh man. How do I just let this end? Let the bread be born. Bumping and grinding of the bread. That is how bread was born and no one will convince me otherwise. Okay, there's the cancel. <laughs> They were the first to go dark in 23. The old dead. Like the rest of them. Sarah, when you come over, will you make me bread? Can you make sourdough bread, though? I don't want any other kind of bread. <laughs> no, but I'm afraid of bread makers. Sarah, why is this conversation making me hungry? Okay, like garlic bread, yes, but there's something amazing about sourdough bread. Pretzel buns? I'm cooking pasta after this, I already know, I'm hungry. It's a necessary conversation to be had. Yes, Erwin, we are, because we need to know if a bread machine is ethical or not. What am I gonna tell my mother now? <laughs> Pretzel buns is your DJ. Oh my god. A little space, please. 
I'll get right up in your face. <coughs> sir, sir. Do you have time to talk about the bread maker? Psst, you. Got water for sale? I'll pay half a crystal per gallon. Yeah. Man, I'm so thirsty. I mean, it sucks to be all. How's New Paris holding up? I have a cousin there. Oh no, Cabby. Sometimes I can't sleep because of the awful sounds the infected outside make. That's an interesting name, though, for a stripper. Why Pretzel. Put on a biomarker and hacked off an infected. Can mean a lot of things. Impurity, that's what I was thinking. I'm thinking it's like a title you get when you reach a certain level of flexibility. But it bumming me out, and I don't feel like work. Just activated yeast, dear God. Look who's here. I ran across the star of the stranger. I will never know peace, Sarah, because of what you have just said. Oh, milk, eggs, veggies, and others. I wonder if they mean bread. Look no further. Is that a cupcake lyric? Previous stones charts for stripper names. Not a bread cult. Let's be a bread cult. It'll be fun. I'm not even sure I want to jump into any main story stuff because, uh... I cannot upload this to YouTube talking about bread cults and strippers. Strippers and bread cults. And strippers who may have been part of a bread cult. That is YouTube's problem. You know what? I concur. I'm gonna hit up the safe zone. Oh, Sensei. You know what? I feel like a stripper named Pretzel would be appreciated. Everyone's used to cinnamon and candy and... What are some stripper names? Twitch mod love strippers. Get this thing off me. Sir, if you need help, please stay over there. Crystal with a K. I like it. Oh, I know where this is. Bread Colts bring in a new audience. That's. Oh, I can't sleep until night? What is that? Since when is that a mechanic? Toasted buns, the stripper. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. Toasted buns. <laughs> As a Twitch mod, Prez cannot comment. Okay. Prez, you cannot go on record. But you can still comment. You just can't go on record. Party at Monroe's. Oh! Cabby, that's a fun game. Nightbot can comment, Prez can't. Okay, dog, band, or stripper, Nightbot, go. Strike that from the record. <laughs> Band? Nightbot? You don't think Nightbot could be a stripper? We don't know what Nightbot does in their spare time. We know nothing about Nightbot.
Prez. What is night? Yep, thank you, Prez. Night. Yep. I was about to say Nightbot understands, but you know what? Prez does understand. Nightbot would have a different stage name. Yeah, the stage name is Prez. That's not my inhibitor. Night job. This is a day job. Oh yes, Exodus, you tuned in at the very best moment pro possible. What if we have a subcult for the bread, but it's nothing but strippers? Like, we have just a cult for strippers. Bar hop, let's go. Impurity, a dom cult? I could see it. Ooh. We should get a dominatrix cult. What can we call them? Are the strippers baking bread? They can be. Or crumpets? <laughs> doms? The doms make subs! Jazz! That is brilliant! A cult of dominatrixes that makes subs. I, I think, you're a marketer at heart, sir. You're a genius. I love that. It would, Subway's mid, man. What you need is a Hooters for subs, but like good subs. Makes perfect sense. I like it. It's gonna happen. This is what we need to do with all the money from the channel we franchise. And then we are never allowed back on Twitch because we are degenerates who have started a dominatrix sub house. Ah, uh, Sarah, I guess you're right. Honestly... I don't think anyone's watching. We'll have to be more careful when I apply again to be partner. Then we will go back to being normal for like half a second. Can you get back to Hakon after getting the first inhibitor in the hospital? The elevator is blocked off. Um, did you go, do you, uh, when you first come out of the elevator, when you first get to that bottom level and you turn to the right, uh, that door that was locked there, are you able to get around it from the other side and unlock it? Like, right after you see the volatile. You should be able to go around and unlock that door and then sneak back into the elevator. Or do you mean the elevator doors are shut? Dom subs an OnlyFan thing? <laughs> Oh, Scar, welcome in. You chose the perfect time. <laughs> Jazz, this is what happened. Maybe they have a Prez on their team who knew this was going to happen and then just stopped. I don't call it. How about a school? For oh, no. Oh, the elevator hatch is closed. Ugh, I'd hate to say it, but you might have to reload that area from the last checkpoint because it shouldn't be. That's how I got out of there. Sarah, you're gonna make the bread with the bread maker? We can make bread! Oh my god, Sarah! We can make bread with my mom! We can use my mom's bread maker! You don't want to spend time with my mother, Sarah? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Pyramid, that's the only advice I can give you because I had to go through the hatch and I think that's the only way to do it. There's some hot bread in chat. Scar, this game is insanely fun. I'm just pausing because there's a couple things I want to do, but I need it to be nighttime to do them. Oh, Infinite, thank you. Oh, I'm not used to that growl. Thank you, 
you, Infinite. Honestly, you guys are the funny ones. I just laugh at what you guys say. We are making moves here, okay? We are making franchising opportunities. While other people have been out there doing niche, we've been making a dominatrix sub shop, and I'm proud. Aw, Scar! I'm happy you're enjoying the RDR2 videos. I'm really happy you came over. Welcome to late night crackhead hours. You are here too. Why is my immunity still going down? I'm in the light. Oh, there we go. We are objectively hilarious. It is your cross to bear. Go ahead and string yourself up on it and just enjoy. I'm actually kind of annoyed at this game in one or two ways, purely because it wouldn't let me explore before, but now that I can't be out in the dark for long, it's like, hey, go do whatever you want, but keep in mind you will become a zombo. You have found your home? Do you mean here on the channel or at the dominatrix sub shop? Because both are valid answers. Sarah, there's your name. Missing the H. above. <laughs> I think a dominatrix sub shop is a great place to call home. Many services. Many great services. And right now I'm hungry enough where all I can think about is food. I'll make pasta after this. Late night pasta is good for the soul. I'm here for one thing in particular that I had to leave behind before. Insomnia Squad. Honestly, just regular bow tie pasta. I used to put, um, I forget the name of the topping. Chimichurri? Chimich I'm definitely pronouncing that terribly. But I put that on my pasta. I just haven't bought any recently. Chimichurri sauce? I think that's how you say it. I need to lockpick this. Now my sister, she makes homemade pasta sauces and she freezes them and sends them home with me. I love her. Okay, I need to go ahead and get out of Dodge. Sensei, yes, you understand the power of that sauce. I originally used to get it on my uh, tilapia, and then I started putting it on everything. Oh, you got this, Aiden. You just have to climb. It's what you were built for, quite literally. Oh, Aiden. Aiden, climb. Aiden, we don't have time for your bullshit. Aiden, 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 Aiden you are a disappointment. Stop objectifying Aiden. This is Aiden's whole purpose in life, okay? Don't start with me, Sarah. I know too much. Um, it's back that way. Jesus Christ. Okay. Ooh, that's a howler. I don't want anything to do with that. All right. Stand directly in the light. And 
we don't have to remind them of that. You know what? Understandable. Why'd you add flexible? Like, I'm not judging. I'm just intrigued. Alright, this is kind of what I want here. Actually... Oh my god. My- the right trigger is so stuck. Because he jumping- I do, <laughs> the flexible pretzel boy is jumping, and that's what makes him flexible. Okay. Sarah, what's going on on your end there? That's, uh, that's what you're thinking about. Craftmaster. Encounter. I don't care about the encounter. I want inhibitors. You're sh we didn't say anything about experience, Sarah. You're the one talking about flexibility. Like... If they have flexibility, do you have reach? Oh, you don't get that joke. Damn it, Sarah. <laughs> Prez, I know too much. I know too much about those thoughts. She's... Impurity, she does not play. The only game that's- I mean, Sarah, you played a couple of video games, but, um, she was on my channel for the very beginning. We started It Takes Two together, and then maybe if we all are really nice to her and we swear to never talk about bread makers again, she might play with me. No, you have to stay and have the himbo conversation. You can't leave now. That's okay. I'll just cry myself to sleep at night. Dreaming of what could have been. But it's okay. You know, because my friend doesn't love me. And she doesn't care about my feelings. All she wants is to think about flexible men. But not her best friend's feelings. It's okay. I love that that guy was like, don't let me die, and I'm like, let me go in the opposite direction. Later, cabbie. <laughs> Prez, she could never divorce me. I would take the kids, the house, the bread maker, the car. She must stay with me forever. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, you can have this. <laughs> I don't know how to thank you. Will this do? Oh my god. Like when your toxic ex leaves and they leave just very specific belongings to piss you off. I just leave her the bread maker. She would leave me for owning a bread maker. Honestly, that would go in our divorce file. I have learned not to question the physics. You know what? As long as he's happy and healthy and I get points for saving him, it's all good. Oh no, impurity. I'm so sorry. Some people's minds be devious, man. Okay, I do not want anything to do with that howler. You'll double divorce me? You'll get married twice. Oh, and waste the money. Just so you can divorce me. Again. Not my coffee maker, no. Okay, you guys don't understand. I am violent without caffeine. Like, you can't, you can't do this to me. I only have one heart and it's legitimately tied to how much caffeine I've had that day. Impurity, that's the best feeling. Just don't deal with the crazy. 
Give yourself some space. Can I not? Oh yeah, I can't roll yet. Like Bane without his microphone mask. <laughs> Prez, I can stop anytime I want, okay? I don't need your opinion. I, I can stop whenever. <laughs> I become the guardian ape because she stole the coffee machine. It would happen. I actually do. Like, I don't know how you got that image of me when someone told me that Starbucks was closed, but it's canon. Sensei, I would die. I already know that I would not be okay. I can barely go a day without caffeine, and I know that's terrible. Yeah. Yeah, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Huh? Huh? What you gonna do? Huh? Huh? What you gonna do? Sarah knows. Sarah knows. I can't do it. I am weak. No, I can stop anytime I want. It's not like it's a real addiction, okay? You guys, you guys are just being sensitive. It's not like it's a real addiction. Could be worse. Oh. I would be a friend of What? This is a Finboy Hooters Jazz, where did that come from? But that sounds great. But also where did that come from? But I would go. Fin boy hooters. Dear lord. Shut up and take my money. A cat boy Applebee's? Oh wait, no, nah, no, nah, that's already on brand. Yeah, that's not inventive. Shit. That's already a thing. Aiden, Aiden, we have to talk about your abilities to run. climbing this one before. Ah, uh, Aiden, why are you a weak boy? We don't have the stamina for any of this. Franchises step it up. He needs some milk. This man needs some steroids because he's holding me back. Crane wouldn't have this problem. Oh no. Ooh, um. Is there a way to report those types of things? That way they can make a patch for it? Because that is annoying, and you're probably not the only person that's having that issue. He needs some squats. I don't know what this man is lifting, but it's not enough. His stuffy little legs aren't helping me any. Oh, 
I don't like this. Naturally made bread. The natural yeast will fix his problems. This lair powerful infected that corrupts the area and reanimates the dead around it. Face a revenant, you need energy area anomaly location at night. Oh, this uh doesn't sound fun. Oh, I see you. Hi. Oh man, you are speedy boy. Aiden, if this were Crane, we would be going and getting that inhibitor. But you are a weak boy. <laughs> Not our boy, Aiden. You know what? You're right. But also, that's just sad. <laughs> Our boy deals with enough. He gets objectified. And then there's the fact that he doesn't have a booty. Hi. Oh! That did not work. No, Sensei. That Hank Hill. You can't do this man like this. He's out here surviving the apocalypse. Even though I can't say you're wrong. Dude, if you're out here on your own, you are just causing your own problems. Oh, this place is messed up. That's not what I want. No, chew, chew, chew. chew. <laughs> That's not fair, impurity. You know it's not. Have some decency. Oh no, 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 I'm not gonna make this. cannot honestly it's scary at night in this game in this one in particular without your upgrades there's the rainstorm I was waiting for it was like what the hell happened to my power before I'll make her go crazy stupid. Ah, Sarah. Pyramid, I kind of agree. I love biohazard, but I'm truly terrified of uh, alien isolation. I have never seen that much of the gameplay, but I'm actually scared of it. I don't like the idea of being hunted. We can't roll. He has a flat booty. Probably not that attractive. He definitely can't pull Hawk on, which is my problem. Aiden, why can't you just do one thing right and romance Hawk on for me? I just need one thing from you. Aiden be kind of lame. Aiden do be kind of lame. Aiden, someday you will reach the level that was Crane, but I don't think it'll be any day soon.
Okay, here's my issue with Aiden. This man was experimented on as a child and sh apparently has some type of superhuman agility compared to everyone else, but he's doing this shit? I think not. Mayhaps he can bake bread. Aiden, my boy, what do you know of the yeast? Him pulling out a bread maker because he doesn't want to do it by hand. Oh, Aiden. How does this make you feel? Oh, there's so many little areas that I desperately need to check. That Loki sounds more human. <laughs> no! Okay. Why well, also got the lights on? Let him talk. I've heard enough of this crap. You better not be here stirring up people's hopes. They're making I bread. Understand. I really do, but I'm telling the truth. I found a cure for THV. They're oh, making man. bread. They've the heard us. Ma'am, can I can I have that? Dozer. Can I have what this bread? Else? You don't Clarence. understand what this will what mean for Aiden's booty. Maybe before he's missing carbs. Doctor, that does not I look like a potato. Alternative medicine. I'll take any medicine. I'm going to say it's bread, Jazz, and you can't tell me otherwise. I made a lot of money. Oh, no. <laughs> Sarah? <laughs> Most people thought it would last I was about to <laughs> Oh man <laughs> I love it It's bread on console That's some sad looking bread That's Sarah's bread, okay Oh Y'all some zombos Oh shit <laughs> Oh Sarah I saw it, but I was like, I'm not going to comment. I'm going to wait till Sarah sees it. <laughs> oh, there's always an inhibitor when it's daytime. And the oh, the inhibitor's in there. Yeah, I don't care to go get it. <laughs> you should have milked it a little while longer, Sarah, and just been like a mildly upset about it. You should have milked it a little bit. <laughs> that was not the car. It's the Lord's. It is the Lord's Day. It's Saturday. You're in a forgiving mood. Aiden and I deal with a lot, okay? My boy, he's working on that leg strength. That way he can land properly. Probably gonna end up just taking him to a safe house and leaving him there. That's not my safe house. Where the hell's my safe house? I need to head back to this area anyway for the main mission later because I gotta get some main mission stuff done. That way I can get this boy a booty. Chella in the bread maker. No, okay. You can't keep denying the power of the bread maker, Sarah. Someday you're gonna have to accept that it exists. I love the mechanic, the jumping on cars is totally okay. Oh yeah, this is one of my safe houses. But this isn't the safe house. 
You turn into the baby. the car. Good Lord. I was gonna say! Y'all just having a funeral with the zombie right there? Confusion. This should be fine. <sighs> Pay his respects. Poor guy. He was just thought he thought he was part of the crew, and then they turned around and whacked him. Okay. This ridiculous blockade at the center. I'm going to leave our boy Aiden here. That way, when I actually go to record, I'm just where I need to be. Oh no, Aiden! I wanted to have you look out over. The city, the desolate city, where everyone's dying. But not you, because you're the main character. He was the reverend. Oh, the zombie reverend. I feel like that would be a cool character. A zombie reverend? Add him as an idea for the DMD game. Let us see. main character, sure. Personally, I think Hakon should be the main character, but that is just my bias talking. Why is the main character always the blandest person? I don't care that you're looking for your sister. I really don't. We will have to pass that along to our DM. Look, don't ask any questions because you left early, but there has to be a bread maker. Just so you know. Radovis? Oh, I am far from it. I still need... Once we get the upgrades in, then I'll actually feel like I have a handle on the game again. But right now, the game feels so lofty. Man character our man is built like a tree and you know what tweaks deserve rights too so roll a d20 and see if you can keep the br i i feel like we need to add that in i feel like we need to add that in because we can't just ignore the lore here it's said in like the medieval age and we just present a bread maker and one of our characters gets burned at the stake. Wait a minute, Sarah, why didn't you just post that in the chat? Okay, the guy that voices Aiden voices Joe from Skate. Skate the Infinity, the anime. I need to finish that because uh, I didn't and I feel terrible. He's built like a cardboard, but we love him. Not the cardboard cutout. Our boy deserves better. He has, I was gonna say he has a personality. He doesn't. I don't even know what he looks like. He's kind of just here. And we appreciate him for that. He voices a lot of anime characters. Sensei, they do have an anime for skateboarding, and it's a, it's a fun time. It is, uh, it's an experience. It, I can't comment on it because I only half watched it, but it's, is it even that much about skateboarding, Sarah? That's true.
He live streams on Twitch? Ooh, that's cool. It's <laughs> Sarah, you're not wrong. You are not wrong. The baiting in that show is quite amazing. Actually, I don't even know if we should technically call it baiting because it is made by the same people who made Banana Fish. So it's kind of like on par. That's up their alley. Let me put my glasses on, my all-seeing glasses. <laughs> Fernand's the meme. It is quite about the gaze, but you know what? That's what makes it good. It gives it some flavor. It makes it interesting. I need to finish it. I really do. The last thing I saw was someone got whacked in the face with a skateboard, and I felt bad for laughing, but it was kind of hilarious. With my nerdy glasses, I need them. If they didn't glare so bad, they wouldn't be nerdy. Sensei, don't look up banana fish. You, it's depressing. It's, it's depressing. Don't do it. It's a very depressing anime. Two male leads in love, but it's sad. Don't watch it. Keep your soul intact. Sometimes you just don't need to know things. Oh, what now? No problem whatsoever. I'm honestly getting a little bit tired, so I was kind of looking for someone to raid on the side. So we will be logging off very soon. And then probably once I get more upgrades, actually, um... Blue Globe, yes. We did not play enough of Dying Light 2 for me to uh, use the footage for it because nothing really interesting happened except for like the first five minutes. But uh, the second row playthrough, I will upload. Because we did get a lot done in Sekiro today. Ignorance is bliss, Lion, so keep it that way. Let's see. Who do we want to raid? Oh, Josh, it's funny how things work out. Thank you so much. I'm happy that you're enjoying the Red Dead videos. Sensei, um, I don't know if she'd be up for it. I don't know if she'd want to pay for the PlayStation Online subscription, the PSN subscription. And also, I would be saving her all the time, but it would be fun. Would be a fun time, Sarah. Keep bullying you for content? I do. I will. And we will bring... We'll bring the bread maker here so you're forced to interact with it. Edward, please have a good night. Thank you so, so much for being here. I'm going to bring the bread maker here so you are forced to interact with it. <laughs> no PS5 and also no bread maker. She refuses to be part of the team. The bread making team. Let us see who is online. Is anyone playing Sekiro for the first time? Let us see. Let me see. Let me see. Shadows die twice, but I want first playthroughs. <laughs> Bullying Sarah is a sport in this community, though. She brought it among herself. Sensei, maybe it's that. Sarah, are you secretly a part of the Amish community and you never wanted to tell me? It's okay if that's the truth. Uh, 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. This, is, this might be fun. The bread making team is the winning team, just like all the people who believe in me in Sekiro are the winning team. She burns barns in her free time. I feel like that's true. Sarah's just on a consistent rumspringa. Oh, it's time to come clean. I am Amish. I don't know how that fits with your other identifiers, but you know what? I believe you. You do you. You live your life. You be happy. Oh no, this person's logging off. No, why are you logging off? <laughs> the village. Okay, hot take though. The village was actually a really good movie. It was one of M. Night Shyamalan's hits. How <laughs> the flexible men make sense. <laughs> ah, Sarah. Rumspringa? That's like when the Amish leave home to try to decide if they want to continue being Amish or, like, go off and do something else. That At least that's what I learned from that one TLC show where they follow Amish kids around. I don't know. We need a person. The only person I follow who's like, oh, actually, that's a lie. The only person I follow who's online that I haven't rated before is BB Jess. But she's a very large creator, so her stuff is probably set to private and friends only. Let's see. Cuban bread to teach Sarah how to use a bread maker. I want sourdough bread. Why does no one give Sin what she wants? I want the sourdough bread. Let's see. I need... I need a person. Oh, Jazz, please. Oh, I hope you're able to get some sleep. You deserve sleep. You must get some sleep. Okay. Ooh. All right. What about, I don't think, uh, I don't know if this is her first playthrough. I'm probably going to have to bounce because she's playing Demon Souls. But there is a creator doing a streamathon of Demon Souls. Or should I look for someone else? We can use soured bread too. No, I need sourdough bread. When you say sour bread, it makes me not trust it. Oh, Sensei, please get some good sleep. Enjoy the gym in the Morzen. In the Morzo. Unless it's already morning, then just enjoy the gym later. <laughs> Errol Wynn, please have a good night. Okay. Lion, that's what you meant. Okay, I don't know. Sometimes I don't trust you guys. Sometimes you guys say things and I'm like, mm, I feel like I'm being gaslit. Dream of yeast. Dream of all the yeast, my friends. Dream of the yeast. Yeast is what it's all about. Yes, Sensei, get those weights in. Hang up a photo of Aiden for motivation and refuse to be like him. Look at that man and be like, his ass is so flat. I could never. And then go do more squats.
the almighty Lord. Rick JD, yes. Okay, we dream of bread yeast. Dream of that. Let us see, let us see, let us see. What is going on here? Narks, the stream is ending. We have been on since six. It has been a long, 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 long day, including a power outage and more long days. Full of yeast and flexible men. The power of yeast and flexible men. A lot of monkey business, if you will. We've had a long day. Oh, Blue Globe, more of this game? I'm definitely going to be uploading more Dying Light to the channel. Erwin, please have a good night. Be well as well. I hope you join us again. All right. Please help me figure out who to raid. Ooh. Who is this? Okay. Oh, any Bioshock players? I rarely see anyone in the Bioshock category. Narks, please have a good night as well. 